There's a lot of screen time that kids get, and there's a lot of television, there's a lot of iPad, but I feel like children are being removed from the physical world. And what we try to do here is to emphasize the importance of understanding how things work. I want to know what a circuit is. Basically like a circle of electricity. Yeah, a circle, right? A circle. We try to explain what is inside a motor, how does a switch work, so that when the kids walk out into the world, they're no longer really consumers, they're like innovators and thinkers. I made a few things. Once I made a grabber, it's like a claw thing. Once I made a vacuum cleaner that actually vacuumed. I was impressed to see when he was explaining things that he knew what circuitry was, and he knew different terms and how things work. They've learned a lot. In the suburbs, when you have a garage, you can take things apart, you can put them back together. And I thought, wouldn't it be cool if New York City had a space for kids to basically be able to do that? They love putting the robots together. They love the actual building process. But then I think what's most fun for them is just making it their own. From monsters to Star Wars, you can make anything. Well, what are you making? Did you tell me? No, it's a secret. It's oh. a surprise. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I care a lot about getting girls into STEM. I care a lot about getting girls to understand how fun it can be. I'm a software developer. Even when I was in college, I could see that some of the guys would be much more comfortable. And I never tinkered as a child. And I really want my daughters to build. So I have been looking for a place like this. In the summer, we have Girls Week, and so that's a space where it's only it's only girls. Every other week is co-ed, and you know whoever can come, but that week is just girls. So adults get really scared to fail, and kids just don't have that yet. So a child will say, "Okay, I want to do a robot like this," and then in our head we're thinking, oh, "That's probably not going to work," but we don't say anything. And then the coolest part is, at the end, the kids' project actually sometimes does work. Yeah, bro, good up. Okay, everyone ready? We're going to do a quiz. Ready? You're going to have to tell me. What is this one? A skill. What is this one? A, a bug. Something simple like right? understanding this. Yeah. Okay. It's a small step to understanding everything else. And if we can make education okay. fun, then it's great for kids. If you enjoy problem solving, which is really what engineering is, if you enjoy being creative, if you enjoy using your hands, if you enjoy making things and problem solving, then this is a really, really fun field to be in. I have a question about what you Okay, I have an answer. Did you buy these or did you just eat the popsicles? <laughs>